Sixth grade, module three, lesson four, classwork, the opposite of a number. Exercise one, walk the number line. Each non-zero integer has an opposite, denoted negative a. Negative a and a are opposites, if they are on the opposite sides of zero and the same distance from zero on the number line. So example one, locate the number eight and its opposite on the number line. Explain how they are related to zero. So first we're gonna locate the number eight. So eight is right here on our number line. So the opposite, as described up here, they're opposites if they're on opposite sides of zero. So here's zero, eight is eight units to the right. So the opposite would be eight units to the left or negative eight. So those two are opposites and we can, I'm going to explain it, let's see, up here. So I'm going to say 8 and negative 8 are the same distance from 0. Since both numbers are the same distance from zero. But are on the opposite sides of the number line. They are opposites. So there's that explanation right there. Number two, locate and label the opposites of the numbers on the number line. So first we have A, so we're looking for the opposite of nine. So nine is right here. We want to find the opposite of nine. So if nine is nine to the right of zero, the opposite would be negative nine. I'm gonna erase that, because we weren't necessarily supposed to graph it. The opposite of negative two, so here's negative two. The opposite of negative two would be two. The opposite of four, there's four, the opposite is negative four. And the opposite of negative seven would be seven. We can go, we can label them. So A was negative nine, B was two, C was negative four, and D was seven. Number three, write the integer that represents the opposite of each situation. Explain what zero means in each situation. So 100 feet above sea level. So if you're above sea level, that's positive. So this is really positive 100. So the opposite would be negative 100. And in this case, zero would represent sea level. Thirty-two degrees below zero. So this is negative thirty-two because it's below zero. So the opposite of thirty-two degrees below zero would be thirty-two degrees Celsius above zero, which would be thirty-two. And here, zero represents zero degrees Celsius. And then a withdrawal of $25. So if you withdraw money, you're taking it out. So this is saying that you're down $25 in your bank account, which is negative 25. So the opposite of that would be 25. And zero 
represents so we're talking about a withdrawal so if you withdraw zero that would be no change to your bank account Example two, a real world example. Maria decides to take a long walk or take a walk along Central Avenue to purchase a book at the bookstore. On her way, she passes the Furry Friends Pet Shop and goes in to look for a new leash for her dog. Furry Friends Pet Shop is seven blocks west of the bookstore. She leaves Furry Friends Pet Shop and walks towards the bookstore to look at some books. After she leaves the bookstore, she heads east for seven blocks and stops at Ray's Pet Shop to see if she can find a new leash at a better price. Which location, if any, is the furthest from Maria while she's at the bookstore? Determine appropriate scale and model the situation on the number line below. Okay, well, we're talking blocks, and the furthest she goes is seven blocks west, and then she heads east for seven blocks to find a new leash. So it looks like I'm just going to put zero in the middle and I'm just going to count by one since the highest number we have is seven. Okay, so let's start with Furry Friends Pet Shop is seven blocks west. So I'm going to, on a map, west would be to the left. So I'm going to go seven blocks to the left. And that is the Furry Friends Pet Shop. So I'm going to label it FF, Furry Friends. And then zero here is where she starts, so that's the bookstore. Then she heads seven blocks east. So after she leaves the bookstore, so she's back at the bookstore here, zero. She heads seven blocks east and stops at Ray's Pet Shop. So seven blocks east would be right here. So that's Ray's Pet Shop. See if she can find a new leash at a better price. Which location, if any, is the furthest from Maria while she's at the bookstore. So what we can see here is that they are the same distance from the bookstore. They're opposites on the number. So we can say the pet stores are the same distance from the bookstore. Each one is seven blocks away, but in opposite directions. And then what does zero represent in the situation? So here zero is the bookstore. Exercises four through six. Read each situation carefully and answer the questions. Number four. On a number line, locate and label a credit of $15 and a debit for the same amount from a bank account. What does zero represent in this situation? I'm going to put zero in the middle, and since we're talking about $15, I have about three tick marks, I'm going to count by five. So five, 10, 15, negative five, negative 10, negative 15. So a credit of $15 that is positive and a debit for the same amount. 
So a debit would be down here, negative. And then what does zero represent in the situation? So zero would represent no change in the balance of the account. Number five, on a number line, locate and label 20 degrees Celsius below zero and 20 degrees Celsius, Celsius above zero. What does zero represent in this situation? So here we have zero, we wanna to get to 20, so I'm gonna count by tens. 10, 20, negative 10, negative 20. So label 20 degrees below zero, that would be right there. and 20 degrees above zero. So above zero would be positive. What does zero represent? So zero would represent zero degrees Celsius. A proton represents a positive change. Write an integer to represent five protons. An electron represents a negative ch charge write an integer to represent three electrons. So first let's write an integer to represent five protons. So a proton is a positive charge. So an integer to represent five protons would be five. If we were to represent three electrons, it says an electron represents a negative charge. So it would be negative three. 